Welcome back again. Here we are in episode four of the Old Dominion Monarchs Dynasty. Looks like we're going to be facing South Carolina today. We're going to try to aim for our first conference win against this South Carolina team. Got us picked to lose, even though we got more total offense and everything than them. Um, South Carolina's 2-1. They lost to Texas A&M, beat Georgia. That's a great win, and beat Vandy. We're 0-2, lost to Army by 2 in fifth overtime, and then lost to Arkansas by 3. Should have took them out last week. Here we go. Let's get it going. So last week, that was a horrible loss to Arkansas. We drove down the field the second to last drive we had. Got all the way down to where we was, I think, maybe 10 yards away from the end zone and threw a pick, <laughs> just like we've done in almost every game. Quarterback lets us down. Hopefully he comes out and plays today and don't let us down. Their top players are Moore, Fry, and Lewis. So we got... McElwain, their QB hurt. That might help us. Let's get it going. Because we get it, so we're going to kick. Hopefully this time it goes good for us. we got to get our offense going a whole lot smoother in the first half. We've been playing really bad in the first half. And putting ourselves in difficult situations. To have to come back from in the second half. Sim D. We stopped him. Okay. Good. So here we go. We're going to run a read option, start the game. So we got our 25. Gonna hit it up the middle of the lobby. He gets about a 10 yard gain almost. He didn't. We were through the ball more last game. He ran 200 the first game. And I think he only got about 60 last game. So, I threw the ball quite a bit. Had over 300 yards passing, just interception per 100 yards, I guess. Good block right there. Barely got him up. In about five. A good pickup, considering he got swarmed and just ran him all over. So, we're on our own 38, trying to keep moving. Going to run another read option. I'm really scared to throw with this QB after the way the past two games have went. Oh. Oh man, I read that wrong. Just tapped A and it made me hand it off. So we're gonna have to throw on second fourteen to get us out of this. Hopefully we can get up to where we can get a run play on third. Oh pick. Oh man. Thank goodness he dropped it. I tried to lead him in it. Threw it right to the hands of a defender. Don't want to run here, even though I would like to be at the option. We're going to run a four vertical. Hits him. The defender just didn't react, thank goodness. Tennessee must have beat LSU because they moved up to number six. Big pickup right there. We're on a read option again. We're on our own. I mean, on their 45 now. Hopefully, move this and get close to the end zone. Pull that. Defender coming. We got a good four yards out of that play. So, let's get second down going. Houston's beating Rice pretty bad. Um, We're going to run a counter. Our offense seems sort of predictable if they watch film, probably. We got the block. Good block. Oh, no, not a good block. Had to break the tackle. Only gets two on that. Moving the ball pretty well right here on the first drive of the game. Be nice if we could pick up an early lead. I don't know if we can kick the field goal that far or not. So here we go. Audible him out of that. Good read. Get it going. Vaughn breaks tackle all the way down to the 25, 15-yard reception. B 
Big gain off a little pass. We're going to halfback draw, see if we can throw him off a little bit. Don't really want to throw when we get down here considering how he's played in the red zone. Passing the ball. Good read right there on the draw. It's about four yards. Okay, we'll take it. So we're going to try to move it in the second six. Try to get a first down. Um, on a shallow cross, I guess. Bond little across the middle. Strong going deep route. There I am scrambling. I'm gonna have to go because of not. So we picked up nothing somehow. I don't understand. So good defensive stop right there from South Carolina. We're gonna come up with some quick slants, try to get a first down here. Third and six. Quick pass, and we get the first down. Beautiful play by Marquise Little. We're going to run a counter to the left side. Washington's not played horrible, not played great. I mean, 43 yards right here. Good blocking to get us all the way to the, I think, 10-yard line maybe. Oh, five-yard, my bad. So here we go with a fullback dive trying to get the first down. So we get it, get the first down. Give me one second, it's lagging. For a second, let me pause. So we're gonna half back dive up the middle. Hopefully it gets open, we can score. We're going to cut it back left, and it looked like he grabbed me by the face mask, but nothing happened. No call. So we pick up a yard on there. We're going to run a power. Oh, I don't like that, actually. So we're going to run a play action pass. And hit our fullback, who gets nowhere. Loses the yard, actually. Kentucky down 14. Takes a and we're gonna run a read option. Hopefully we can read it right and get in here. Washington breaks up two tackles and he gets in. Washington finally does something good on the season. Gets us a touchdown to start the game. Broke two tackles to get there. Sim the D. He stops South Carolina. We do stop them as they miss a 52 yard field goal. Come out, let's quick slant this, get it going early. As Pascal is wide open across the middle, getting us across the 50. So here we go with a counter Y. We're going to run to the left side. So we're right directly in the middle of the field. So, come on, Lowry. Good pickup block right there. Cut it up now. Good game. Six-yard game from Lowry. We're still trying to move this ball to the end zone. Well, he's played really good and solid for us this season. We're going to give him a draw. My quarterback can pick up and stop throwing interceptions. We'd probably be 2-0 right now. We probably would have beat Arkansas. It's been a very big win as I read that wrong. Loses a yard. We go third and five. We're across midfield, though, so that's a good sign. We're going to run a shallow cross. Should cut right to the middle right there instead of just going to the left side. Lob it up. Good D, though. Fourth and five. They're going to try to tell me to punt. And honestly, I want to go for it, but I'm going to punt it because that's probably the smart thing to do for us. I'll try to pin them deep back in their own. So a solid leg right there. So it probably goes out about the nine. Let's see where it went out at. Goes out at the 13. It's a great punt. Gives them bad field position. Let's see if the defense can hold them. 
They're moving it well, and they have to punt it, so we get the ball back. We're playing a good, stout defensive game against South Carolina. 2-12 to the goal. Let's see if we can drive this down the field and get up by two scores. If we get the ball back at half, that could be very big. No block right there from number 66 as he just runs on outside. If he could have pinned that guy, I could have cut it up in the middle and been gone. So here we go, 158 to go in this game. We're going to have to pass. So the run game's not going to get us down the field in that amount of time. So... He's going to slant across, and a defensive play as he just dives out. If he would have missed, I would have got it, and I would have been gone. But here we go, third and six. South Carolina going to try to get a stop. And if they do, they get the ball back with pretty good time. I'll be able to score and flip this game around and change it right here for the first half. Ends. They leave Duhart wide open. So he gets a big 20-yard reception almost. Big game from Duhart. We're going to four verticals. Horrible ball, I know. Good defense, though. I thought he might cut a little bit further out. I might be able to hit him on the back side of that guy's arm. Corner strikes, what we're going to run. This right here is a tough pass to put anywhere. You're about to float this in. Sent the blitz. I'm getting sacked. Loss of five. Third and 15. They didn't call a timeout. I'm just going to run the clock down try to get an escape. Maybe the first down, but I'm going to try to let some clock run. Save us a little bit. <laughs> Bond cuts in front of him as I self control. So now we're going to have to be in a hurry because I didn't think I was going to get that first down, to be honest with you. I'd like to at least get a field goal out of this. Field goal would be nice. Still put us up by two possessions. It's a little wiggle room. Good pass to Hart. Let's call a timeout. Four or three seconds left. Probably 40 yards to go. Exactly 40 yards to go. Let's try to move this ball some more. We go with a quick slant. It's worked for us. We're going to hit that little. Oh, mine. Boy just stepped up and it would have left my guy wide open if I would have caught it. So, third and two. We got to get a first down here. And we're going to have back sting up the middle. Try to just pick up the first down because we ain't even in field goal range yet. Cut it right. Uh, good run to almost the 30. Gonna get up and try to hurry up so we don't have to waste two timeouts. Waste another timeout. So we're gonna have to All I want us to do is play action, so we're gonna play action boot. Come on now, Washington, it's the clock. Oh my god, not this is play action, so it's gonna run. Beautiful game by my QB as he just goes around nine yards. One timeout left. If we can keep first downs rolling, we're on the 25. Big possession here. Don't want to run it because I want to show a score, but maybe run it and take a field goal. Some of y'all probably saying I need to run it and be safe, but I hit my lorry up the middle. 18 seconds to go. We're going to hurry this one up. If we pick up one more first down, we might be in shape to score. We're going to slant's middle. If I do hard at the middle to the five. Beautiful read right there. We're going to try to run and hurry up again. Turn some more slants. So my quarterback takes it. Touchdown, David Washington. Smart decision as he's seen that the passes was not going to be able to be completed. He takes off with it and scores for us. Beautiful score. So we're going to send that play. We're going to come out here and we're going to catch the kick. 14 to nothing lead for Old Dominion. The second half starts. 
big lead. Probably the biggest lead we've had all season. Might be the only lead we have, except in that overtime game. Brickhouse breaking a tackle. Maybe got us to the 25. Here we go. Let's see if the offense can still flow. We've been a second-half team all year. Hopefully it didn't flip in this game. Bad read. Looks like I tips it up. Could have been picked there. We are on a read option. Try to get back in our flow of things. <sighs> Pull it. Cut up. Good blocking. Good blocking. David Washington finally breaks free for almost 20. Oh, my. Beautiful run right there by David Washington. We got to do some adjustments. We're going to crank up the clock. Try to chew it. Get out of here with a victory, even if we can't score again. But a beautiful run right there by my QB, Washington. He's playing all right today. Make the block. Cut it up. Cut it up. Uh, good blocking. Good blocking. Oh, man. I was trying to get the first. Lowry's mad. So he gets drugged down from behind. He's got 51 yards in this game. A read option again. Pull it. Cut it up field. Try to truck the guy and get laid out, but good run out there by Washington. He's got 41 today. That big 20-yarder was a big deal, though. On second and 10, gets us the first down. Probably saved this drive. We hit Gamonte Jackson for a three-yard gain. Just a quick out. Now we're going to run a triple option lead to the left. i got to hurry this hike up, though, because it's down to five. We're good. Pulls it. Flicks it out last second. Lowry breaks a tackle. A good gain right there, probably about 13 on the carry. Beautiful, beautiful ram play by the offense. Holds it right to the last second to get him open. So here we go with the quick slant, trying to play this game very well, very effective. Uh, gets a little wide open as they slide back in, I think, a cover two, cover three maybe. Leaves him open right there on the left side. So we're on the 11-yard line. We're going to run a read option again. He's passing ball really well. 136 yards, no touchdowns, no interceptions. But So there we go. We get them all. Oh, nope, the guy steps back at the last second. Beautiful defensive play. As long as we don't turn it over, though, let's run a triple option to the right. As long as we don't turn it over, we can make this a three-possession game here. Beautiful just, like, crash. We're getting two off of it. More we would have got if my quarterback would have ran it, but. Third and 12, we got to throw here and try to get in the end zone. Don't want to try a screen. We're on a quick slant because it's worked for us all day. We hit little. Can you pick up the first? Fourth and inches. We got to take a field goal here. I'm not going to chance it. Get out of here and get nothing. So let's do a chip shot. We make it. Barely. It looked like I missed. Florida beating Tennessee. By eight. It's Florida 0 3, Tennessee 3 0. Dobbs has a touchdown to Juwan Jennings. Medley's made two field goals. Tennessee's offense just must not be able to get flowing on that Florida D. So here we go. Let's see what our D can do, if they can hold. If they can, I think we'll secure the lock on this game. And we get them to punt. So here we are, up 17. About to go into the fourth quarter. 19 seconds left in the third. Trying to get out of here with a victory which will be our first victory. Beautiful read right there to Duhart. Gets us the first down. Breaks a tackle. 15-yard gain, I'd say. 55 yards on the day. Beautiful gain from him. It's going to go into the fourth quarter now. 
David Washington with 170 yards almost on 14 passes. So we were on a dive. Lowry picks up maybe six. Oh my God, gets back up. Picks up eight probably. <laughs> I don't know how the heck he got back up, but I'll take it. Run another dive, try to get the first down here. So we're just running clock. Pick up the first. There we go. On a six yard gain. I mean, that's all day. Florida goes up by 15 points on Tennessee. That might put them out of reach right there with 10 minutes to go, but it's untelling. Two possessions in 10 minutes. It'll be great drives, which they've not been able to put together all game, I don't think. So there's a pass to Pascal. First down. It's 4.50 to go in this game. We're moving the ball very well, and our defense have played a stout, stout game. Might help that their quarterback's out, but that's just part of football. 175 yards. He's playing really well. We're going to give it to Lowry up the gut. Good cut. Good read. Maybe 5-7. Okay, that's a good seven. Takes a ms up by 28 on Kentucky. With seven minutes to go, Tennessee still not done anything. LSU's beating Auburn by 18. So we got Florida State killing, not really killing. Only beating an FCS South team by 19. Good pass to Pascal inside the 10 to the 9-yard line. Our offense is looking great this game. Just playing very well together, playing as a unit. We're on a quick base. So we're going to run a, So you got to cut it up. Oh, my gosh. He just plows the guy. I don't think he got anywhere, but that was a beautiful truck. So we're going to – second and eight – I mean, second and go on the eight-yard line. We're going to run some slants. Try to get in here. Passes it to Duhart, and he can't get in. Are you serious? As he's on the line, still not a touchdown. Would have been David Washington's first touchdown pass of the season. He'd have been happy. <laughs> We're going to run a counter because they've worked all season for us. Hopefully we can go up one block, maybe two block and get in. He's going to cut it up the middle. Good run right there by Lowry. Good read also. So we're going to go up in this game by 24. I think that's put it up <laughs> with only two minutes to go. Can we get a shutout, though, is the question. Good D there. Let's go out here and get out of this game. We have just murdered this South Carolina team. Bounce it outside because nobody's there. Lowry going up the sideline as he's to the one-yard line. Oh, my gosh. He said, I'm laying it on him, son, as he picks up his hundredth, his second hundredth yard game of the season. We're going to fullback dive as I thought he was taking that one to the house. South Carolina's got to be ashamed of their D today. Touchdown, Cox. So we're going to go up 31 to nothing on this South Carolina team. Just I don't know what's got into our defense. Offense playing a great game. We stop them as we pick it off. We're going to run it again just to, you know, waste clock. Don't want to run it with my QB any. Don't take a chance on getting him hurt. But goodness gracious, have we really laid it on this South Carolina team. The backups are in. This game is over. Twenty seconds left. One more play should do it. South Carolina's probably ashamed of theirself. Oh, Dominion feeling good as they're going to pick up their first victory. And talking about making a statement in week three, they're going to go out of here 31 to nothing at South Carolina, playing a beautiful offensive game, beautiful defensive game, no interceptions, no turnovers. That's what it takes to win in the SEC. Let's check the stats of this game. I mean, a beautiful, beautiful, well-played game. I leveled up again as a head coach playing stats. We got David Washington coming out here 17 of 23 with 198 total passing yards. 
Lowry with 111 rushing yards and a rushing touchdown. We got Washington running for 37 yards and two touchdowns. Cox with one yard on two attempts and one rushing touchdown. Beautiful receiving game. Just still can't find our way to get our receivers in the end zone. <laughs> it's already two. Week three, no passing touchdowns. So, big win right there. Thanks for watching. Come again to episode four. See you later.